just dropped this hoodie, built-in gator, and a blaze orange hat just in time for hunting season. Just a quick little drop before we get restocked for Black Friday. So go to the website, check it out, and let's get into the video. Ten months. Ten months. All right, so you guys saw last video. Ken won the preliminary race to determine who gets to be Haley Deegan's co-driver in the 2.4 hours of Le Mullets. Today is dedicated to training Ken for his big race day. Uh, we got three weeks. Fall along, we had a full gym put in, a workout facility for Ken, so he doesn't have to leave the comfort of his own shop. <laughs> I would imagine he's gonna be spending most of his time either here or behind the wheel over the next three weeks. We also got another surprise for him, you'll see in a little bit. All right, go and give me Ken! Basically, I'm just gonna yell at Ken all day through this megaphone. Sounds like your dream. <laughs> DJ's living on my dream job right now. Ken Mathis. Ken Mathis. Drop and give me Ken. Who's Ken Mathis? I'm just gonna keep saying his name wrong the whole time. Ken's gonna hate every second of this. I think this is gonna be Ken's first time working out. <laughs> I don't even think shit. Yeah, how do we keep Ken on pace? Because you know he's gonna quit immediately. Just leave it to me. Okay. I do this for a living. So Ken has no idea what we're doing today. He thinks we're just showing up for a normal filming day. He's got a rude awakening ahead of him. <laughs> we need to get Micah a megaphone for every time he speaks on camera so we don't have to turn up the volume. <laughs> we're gonna make Mike join Ken in training today as punishment because uh, Mike likes to go out and get up on days when we have to be here early and film. Yeah, we gotta put Micah through the same training course. Hey, Mike, this you're not training for anything. We're just trying to make you into a what? normal civilian. This is just obedience training. <laughs> yeah. Did you see his text? To quite possibly no one's surprise, I will not be to the shop by 11. I can't and then he comes up with some shitty excuses and then says that's why I won't be. The thing that I think is funny, he was like arguing against us when we were like, dude, you're gonna be late tomorrow. We like, know you better than you know you. Yeah, last night, Ben tells, hey, Mike, let's plan to film at 11 tomorrow, please be back, so we don't have to wait for you. He responds, okay. CJ emphasizes the text about two hours later, Mike responds, okay. I say, would be greatly appreciated. Thanks, Mike. He goes, I didn't drive. I told Pat and Jake that I need to be back by at 11. Pat said he has to be back early too, so that's not an issue. We're having a really good time, not getting crazy. Have a good night, kids. <laughs> and then proceeded to not even leave the town two hours away until after he was supposed to be here. Okay, let's go. Ken Mathis! Ken Mathis! What's up? Ken Mathis! Today's training day! Ah, holy fuck, CJ, it's hot! Oh my god! Get up, get up! I'm not supposed to go that way! Oh my god! Ken Mathis! I'm supposed to hit it down, I'm sorry. Are you okay? Well, I got hot, hot fucking coffee on my face, so no. You seem okay now. I'm sorry, I wasn't supposed to do that. Just fucking think before you do some things. We don't have time to think, Ken. We have three weeks till the race day. I'll be your drill sergeant for the race day. I'll be your drill sergeant for the race day. Don't touch the batter. Sergeant! Get back! The train doesn't stop. This is going to be a long, growing three weeks, but come race day, you're going to be physically and mentally prepared. Okay. 20. No. We need to break that spirit. Let's hear a yes. Drop and give me 10, Ken. Drop and give me 10. One. You get it, one. That's it. We'll, we'll keep working at that. It's the first day. All right, a little call for the... Oh, all right. Let's get out here. Oh, watch the light. All right, let's get 10. Shout that in my ear. <laughs> and in full race car fashion, the doorknobs have been removed. Oh, the inside doesn't work either? It does no. not open. Go, yeah. 
Go leg, both legs first. That works better. I just, yeah, there you go. Damn, dude. This thing doesn't have any power. <laughs> well, Ken, it's the best we could do. This. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa! You cut this that? side, but you didn't it's cut that side? I didn't think he was gonna f***ing do that! God damn it, Ken! I knew we should have broke the handle off that one, too. We got, uh... Oh, so you broke the handles off! Well... I think he has to crawl through the window. Let's just break the handle. Come, on, come over back here. <laughs> look, look at his face. Love this sticker! See? Ken, we really did some nice things for you here today. Besides the coffee. Sorry about that again. But anyways, let's uh, get to racing. What do you think? You really started this off on the worst possible Okay, note. besides for that. What do you think of your new car? Kind of sick. I love the stickers on it. You do? Yeah. The, the one on the hood kind of sucks, but the rest of them are sick. That's literally your face, Ken. Okay, so we're all on equal playing fields, or relatively equal playing fields. We picked up a Buick, a Jetta, and then a uh, Impala, and then Tint brought over, what is this, a Camry? It's a big Cam in it. It's an Accord. We did all this for you, Ken. Huh? Well, you didn't fuck my mood. Huh? No, you didn't fuck my mood for today. Okay, all right, come on, chill. <laughs> so the plan is to line up, and we'll do a race around the compound. You know, get Ken ready for that, and then it'll probably, it'll probably end in demo derby. I hope it doesn't, because I kind of want Ken to have to daily the Crown Vic for the next little bit. But we'll see if it makes it through the day. Holy <laughs> shit! Oh! Oh! Oh, hey, Mike. Hi. Honestly, earlier than I thought. Yeah, okay. I'm same. <laughs> to, be honest, to be honest with you, we made really good time. Hey, don't bring a vacuum around that guy. <laughs> don't bring a vacuum the last that. time we were at Pat's. No, uh, we Mike, were... I don't know if we can tell this story. No, it's not that bad. Jake takes the vacuum out, he's like, and he puts it up, and then I just take my... in the middle of all of it. That's yeah, all I dude, wanted to do. Yeah, turned into a literal demo derby right out the gate. Dude, Ken just gave me two flat tires. Dude, this coffee thing is really backfired on us oh. today. All right, let's do this before any more damage. That's a lot of damage. Every car's tire except for tins now? You're popping everyone's tires today, Ken. Well, I'm taking out the competition. We haven't even started racing yet.
doesn't run. You blew it up? I, I think so. <laughs> what? I don't know what the f I did. Maybe it was luck that he won. Are you saying we did all this for Ken when it was supposed to be me? <laughs> I don't know. He got lucky, apparently. What the hell did I make you NASCAR graphic for? <laughs> Hey guys, 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 we could just fill it in right here. No bend racing. <laughs> All right, Ken's car died, but we're gonna throw him in a different car, carry on the race. All right, guys, go! Oh! Oh my God, Ken! hurts a little bit yeah. actually. I think my bell got wrong and threaded the guinea. Dude, you guys are getting rocked. Ow, my god. Ow, that one hurt. Ow. That's our berm, buddy! That's a wrap, that was a lot of fun. Hats how to destroy five vehicles in like, what, two hours? Five vehicles, one drone, and a pit bike track. A little bit of a shop update. You guys saw it kind of briefly in the beginning of this video, but we just got all this gym equipment. We just cleared out all this space. It's not done yet, but we're gonna be putting like rubber flooring in, mirrors, paint it. Uh, TV, all that shit, and kind of have like our own little workout area, which is gonna be super nice because we spend so much time driving back and forth from the gym. I don't. <laughs> Mike just doesn't excuse. go. Not we have an excuse. Do, we spend so much time. It just takes. Well, too driving. <laughs> wouldn't we do go? I cannot do that. Let's just see if you can. Oh, you got it. You got it. You got it. Nice, Mike. Nice, Mike. Come, Come on, on, Mike. Mike. Yeah. All right. Woo! Holy Ken, how much was it? I only did mine for this video. Ken! Oh, Ken! Just one. You do love doing just I one. I did it for this video. That's not how working out works. <laughs> just come on, one Ken, one rep. I'll do it too. I'll do it too. No, 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 Ryan. Ryan let, me, let, me, let me have my moment to shine, dude. Jeez, Ryan, why grip much? <laughs> Holy crap. Easy That's money for Ryan. He just did two. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Ken, come on, bro. Just rep one out for us. For the people at oh, home. Mike, Mike is wearing the t-shirt, actually. Ken! Come oh, on, dude. Are you scared it's gonna hurt you? I, I just said no. <laughs> you guys think it's it's like a joke, but it's real life at this point. I mean, it's a lifestyle for Ken. He's been, <laughs> he's been living it since he was like two. His first word, actually, his mom told me was no. <laughs> <laughs> the Grind Fitness, they sponsored this for us. They heard we were trying to build our own shop. 
gym because we literally waste so much time driving back and forth to the gym, some of us. It takes up a lot of your day, so it's really nice having a good setup at your home or your shop or wherever. And I'm very impressed, honestly. I've spent quite a bit of time at the gym. And this stuff is, is seriously like sturdy, it's well built. One of the major things that Grind tries to focus on is staying affordable with their heavy duty equipment, and they definitely do. Cause for the longest time we were actually trying to build a gym and it's just like, it's ridiculously yeah. expensive. So we got the Chaos Half Rack. This works for obviously bench press as you saw, and then it doubles for squatting. J cups to hold it, and then also the spotter arms in case you're going a little heavy. And then we also got the Olympic bar with it, easy curl bar and then an adjustable bench so you can do some incline, whatnot. It also came with the midnight bumper plates. Grind is running a sale all of November and they always have free shipping. So if you guys are trying to get your own home gym set up like ours or even just some of these pieces, you can head over there right now, save some money. We're gonna have it linked down below in the description. Thank you so much to Grind Fitness for sponsoring this video. We love this thing and uh, it's gonna look sick once we get the other side done. Captain Ken, Captain Ken. Hey Ken, show these recruits how it's done and drop and give me 10. <laughs> no, Ken, we're partners in this, Ken. Come on now. We're both having a good time, Ken. No, don't ruin this now. Boo! Or should I say, moo! <laughs> anyway, we're dressed up for Halloween, so this is pretty cool. We got the big limo now because we need it. <laughs>